Now guys, so I'm going to show you how to make an emissive map. <laughs> right, so pretty much I'm going to show you how to make a item glow, which is what emission does. Right, so we're going to quickly disable what we've got so far. Just click apply. Right, so we're going to set off with nothing in our material. Look, just plain old black. Alright, so open up your material. And this is really, really simple. It's going to be a very quick tutorial. Hold free, left click to get your um, free vector, constant free vector. And uh, let's make a blue one this time. That's purple. We're going to make a purple one this time. So get your color, connect that up, and that will just give you color. If you watch my basic tutorial, um, basic material tutorial, you'll obviously get now to that. So yeah, that's fine. No emission though. So what you want to do, if you just connect it up to emissive color, you will get some emission. Like it will sort of, if I make it pitch black in the room, it will and actually it will glow, like a glow stick. But not it won't actually sort of light up. So just do this. Just hold M, left click, make a, multi, then make a multiply tab. Put it into there. Put it into there. Now in here, just put in like twenty. Let's make it really bright. There we go. And if we just look at the object, if we minimize this, there you go. Right, I am my. Auto mag emissive, auto mag, um, there we go. Auto mag exposure when you go too close to it, like thingies, but yeah. There we go. Well, that's pretty much how to set up your emissive material. I hope that helps anyone get emissives done because it was pr it's pretty simple to do. Uh, thank you very much for watching and bye bye.